How's it going? How you been? Doing well. Doing well. Well, considering that I've been a couch potato since I've been back from China, um, surprisingly good. You know, it's okay. I still got a long ways to go. How long have you been back? Uh, I got back like the end of, towards the end of February. Yeah. Did you have an inkling that this was no. going to happen? No. Came out of the blue? No. Uh, my agent told me uh, when I was over in China <clears throat> that he was talking to him, and even when I got back, you know, there were still talks, but I kind of stayed in shape just in case, you know, that, that call was going to happen. But, you know, after a month, you know, a month and a half went by, uh, nothing. So, you know, I kind of just relaxed a little bit and out of the blue, here we go. <laughs> when, when did the call come exactly? Sunday. Sunday. Yeah. It happened Sunday. I was getting out of church and I looked at my phone and Pop called me. I was like, oh, gosh, what the heck? So it was, it was, it was a shocker. So your prayers were answered? Basically? Yeah, yeah, you can say that. <laughs> Cause, I, well, I'll tell you, my wife was praying, praying for it. So, so he, he like, I just want to keep hanging out on this couch a little bit. <laughs> I'll tell you, I got real relaxed, you know, I was with my kids because the whole time I was in China, I, I didn't see my kids. You know, that's four months went by, so I was enjoying my time off. Is that in Houston where you live? Yes. Well, how good of a situation is this for you to walk into a team that can make a run at the this, title? This, this, this is unbelievable. You know, just a championship environment, um, something that I really haven't been a part of my whole career. Um, you know, I'm, I'm very excited. You know, I'm, I'm humble for the opportunity, and, you know, I'm not sure if I'll play or when I'll play. It's not the case for me. Um, just know that when my number is called, I'll be ready to play, and, uh, you know, I'm just glad to be here. Has Pop or anybody ribbed you about 13 points in 35 seconds yet? Uh, not quite. You know, he just, you know, um, made some jokes here and there about me, you know, busting his ass a few times <laughs> over the years. But, you know, you know it, was, it, was, it was a tough team to play against. Um, now I'm glad to be on their side. Is that, a, is that a night that stuck with you just as a memory over the, over the years? Well, my, my Asian fans won't let it go. I mean, <laughs> that's just like the, the best thing um, ever. You know, every, every time um, I'm over there, that's all they really talk about. Um, and every Asian person I see, that's, that's the only thing they bring up. So I can never forget it. So I imagine you heard it a lot when you were in China. I heard it a lot. I, I think they had a day where they celebrated it. <laughs> <laughs> I, and I'm not joking. <laughs> what, what was your Chinese nick? A lot of players get these kind of goofy, cool Chinese nicknames. Did you? Well, my, my name over there is Mighty. Mighty? Mighty, yeah. So I'm, I'm Mighty to the Chinese people. I think that's, um, I forgot what, beautiful or something like that. So. It's an awesome name. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> you had a great career, obviously, but can you just speak uh, a little bit to the fact that you never won a playoff series and to have an opportunity with this team that's yeah. won a lot? Well, I, I think so much is made that I've never really got past the first round, but, you know, it's, it's, it takes more than just me. And if you look at what I did in the regular season, and if you look at my playoff numbers, I've always stepped up in the playoffs. So, you know, I mean, it's just some team, you know, the teams that we faced was obviously better than us. I mean, it just didn't happen. And a couple of times with the Rockets, you know, we played series without Yao. I mean, how difficult is that to not have your other star guy? So, you know, I've just been unfortunate situations that I've been in. Orlando, my whole playoff career there, I didn't have Grant Hill. So, I mean, it's, it's good to be a part of a team that with the tradition of winning championships and expect greatness around here. So, and no pressures on me, you know. <laughs> How's your knee? I feel good. I feel, I feel real good. You know, it took uh, a few years after my surgery to get to feeling back healthy. And I think more so, uh, getting past the mental block, you know, it was tough to get past that. And, you know, guys that have knee surgery and that's really struggling to come back like Derrick Rose, for instance, I know, I know what it takes. Could you play some backup point guard? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I'm, I'm accustomed to handling the ball and making the decisions on the basketball court. Have you had to alter or change your game as you've gotten older? Yes. And, and in what ways have you, have you done that? Well, I'm not as quick as I used to be. <laughs> I'll slow it down a little bit. Uh, I think more so my game is in the mid-post area. Um, I've developed, you know, upper body strength, lower body strength, and my footwork has always been good. So I'm kind of changing in that sense. I mean, these guys are far more younger 
in the league nowadays much quicker. So it doesn't make no sense to me to handle the ball out there on the perimeter and try to take these guys off the dribble. Just make it easy and stay on the, the mid post. One dribble to the basket, foul. Simplify it. Speaking of age, when you look around and you see uh, Tim Duncan doing what he does. Phenomenal. Is he, is he like an inspiration to you? I mean, phenomenal. He and, and Kobe, yeah, they're phenomenal, man. These guys are, you know, not because of their, their age, it's just the miles that they have on their body. I mean, these guys that's been, you know, deep in the playoffs every year. And for him to be playing as well as he is is just incredible. How many kids you got? Four. Four. Two boys, two, two girls. Boys, two girls. Yeah. What are the ages? Uh, ten, seven, five, and four. Ooh, you got a full, full house. Huh? <sighs> Come help me. <laughs> you had a good time, huh? I had a great time, yeah. When yeah. did the season end in China? You got back in February. When did it end? Uh, for me, it ended February, like, 18th was my last game. And I came back, yes. How would you rate the competition over there? Actually, it's a, it's a physical game. It's a phys very physical game to let you play. Um, no, it's... Talent is not NBA talent, but you have some guys. I mean, guys can play. You know, and you also have some mixture of NBA guys over there. Um, two foreigners on it, every team. So the talent was, was pretty good. I mean, I enjoyed the competition.